All right, and so we are about to select our second mastery as we were kind of just running through and leveling up in the prior episode. We're going to go ahead and choose a second mastery. Now, we already have nature, which is the wolf pack, and it's very viable. It's very powerful. These wolves are, are really great. Good choice. Um, but I think we'll go ahead and do the warrior, the warfare area, to even buff up more strength, more melee type builds. I love that. Melee, combination of melee and having a wolf pack does sound pretty intriguing. So let's try it. We'll choose that as our second mastery. Wow, and so we have a total of seven unused skill points. And, um, obviously we need to put a point in here to then access these first abilities here. So, we have something called Weapons Training, which gives you offensive ability and t attack speed. I think that's going to be default. We got to put at least a point or two in that. Uh, next up is Battle Rage. Um, I guess it can make you go into a rage once you get hit a few times, apparently. Let's see what the other one is. Onslaught. When used to default weapon attack, Onslaught charges you up. That might be kind of cool, too. So, I'm thinking, actually, this weapons training and Onslaught might be something for now, that needs to be selected. So we'll put a point in weapon training, and a point in onslaught for now. It says when used. I'm assuming that onslaught is something we're going to be putting here in our bar. Let's see. Oh yeah, it is. Let's uh, put Call of the Wild to number two. Onslaught will be one. Actually, you know what? Since we don't use Heart of Oak very often, because we only cast it once, I'm going to put Heart of Oak on, like, number eight. I'm going to put Onslaught on my right click. Can we do that? Oh, yeah, we can. Onslaught. Right click it. And Call of the Wild. Wait. Call of, the, call of the Wild, just put it back on one, I guess. Make that empty. Yeah, so we have a right-clickable onslaught when it's available. Be good. So we got four unused skill points still. Let's go back over to Nature Mastery. And put a few points... Um, I'm definitely going to put one point more in Heart of Oak because it looks like the next level up is going to give an additional 25% health to the entire pack, including myself. Which, that's very helpful. One point there. And... We should probably spend a point in both of these. So, another point in Call of the Wild. And I think we'll just put one more so far. Yeah, for additional bleeding damage into Maul. And we have one unused skill point. Let's go back to Warfare. Um, let's see. Level 2. Oh, we get quite a bit more offensive ability. Let's do another one. One point in Weapons Training. And we're done. Let's see how that pans out. Should be good. Let's recast our wolves. And we'll recast the other wolf here in a minute when the cooldown is done. Yeah, that's a long, long cooldown. So that one got recast to level 8. This wolf is still level 7, that's why we want to recast him too. 
There we go, now we both have level 8 wolves. Alright, off we go. And let's see if all this upgrade has been helpful to us. Here we go, let's test it out. Boom. Not bad. Not bad. I mean, we still get hurt. But it's definitely... We're still tearing stuff up. That's for sure. We're, we're definitely not scared of anything by any means. Okay, there's nothing there. Clear this out back here, whatever this is. Whoa, new air, new, uh, new enemy, a spider. Kind of creepy. Creepy crawler. Oh, look at a whole pack of spiders. Yeah, they, they fall like nothing. Insectoid spider. Yeah. That's pretty funny. Okay, so we're just going to do a quick run through of this whole area. Uh, we don't want any of that. I don't really care. You know, maybe I should pick up a health potion. I mean, an energy potion. Let's pick them up. Because... I mean, I might as well use them. It doesn't look like I'm regenerating energy at all. So maybe, maybe I do have to use them. Oh, look at these baby spiders. Little tiny wee baby spider. Alright, so here's... I think there's a cave coming up here. What? Those little spiders are level 14. Oh, the moment. It's funny. Okay. So. Let's, um... Pop. Uh, let's see. I wonder why I'm not regaining energy. That's kind of weird. A hundred reserves. I don't know what that means. I don't know why it says 100 reserved and I'm not full with, I'm not full with uh, with energy. I don't believe I'm really using any energy. Oh well, I'm not too worried about this. All right, let's see what this whole cave the beach collar band, that's kind of cool. See, this is, this is a good band, I think. Bonus to all pets. The same as the other one that I already have. Yeah. No bother. Alright, let's kill this stuff and see. Wow, level 12. Oh, gosh. I pay attention. Loop of agility. Yeah. I'm just not going to bother with any of this stuff. Alright. Let's just kill all this stuff in here. There's really nothing in here to be had. I don't, I don't know what this cave is all about. Some kind of random little cave. So this whole area was just like a dead end. So we'll just go ahead and run back quick. 
I really don't like dead ends because it's kind of like there's no action and you're just running around doing nothing. Alright, so here's an area. Here we go. I'm noticing it's taking longer to level up. I guess because we're not killing as fast as we once were. Alright, dude, you're, you're gonna die. There we go. Check out the chest. Food buckler of recovery. Let's see what that is. Health regeneration per second. I'm gonna use it. Look at that. M plus 39 health regeneration. Wow, that's way better than just energy. Drop that thing. Oh yeah, look how fast it regenerates health. That is pretty sweet. Anything to help help energy or uh, health regen, that's really nice. Okay, it looks like the only way to go is up. Yeah, there's nothing over here. I think we're going to be very close to, um... We're going to be so close to the town Magira, I think. Oh, we're, we're already there. Tagia. We got to the town called Tagia. Alright, let's run around here and see if we can't talk to some people. Oh, all this. Okay, here's a guy. The water by our village has gone foul. It happened just the day before last, after the first satyr was spotted. My sister got sick, and then my neighbor. Alright, new quest, the poison spring. I have a feeling, what do you bet, it's going to be up this way, up here. Let's do it, we'll run through it. Wow, look at these spiders. Interesting color. Yeah, there's spiders everywhere. Okay, we will fix this poison spring for the town. Oh, who's this? Look at that. Mortal, I am a naiad, the spirit of this spring. Fajia, I am called. My water has been tainted and I am ill. Vile spiders have come to dwell in a cave by my water's source. They are the cause of the poison. That's what I thought. Okay. Alright, well, I guess we're going to have to help fix that situation. Probably that cave. Let's go in there. Let's just do it. Let's just do this. Kill all these spiders. And we will save mankind. Save the town. We are definitely not very weak, that's for sure. Alright. Get a bone pile, let's see what we got. Not too much. Oh, here's a bigger chest. Ooh, look, we got a blue drop. That is sweet. We're gonna check that out here. Let's see, what do we got? Nice, nice, nice. Need level nine. Required strength, 133. Wow, this is a nice set piece. 
as you can tell, the Tebin, uh, the, what, the Tebin Bracers are a part of a five-piece set, which is kind of cool, and it looks like it's strength-related. Can't use it yet. Need one more level. Definitely will use it at some point. Great, great. That's always good to see the set items dropping. Alright, let's kill all of you. And we need to figure out where the poisoned water source is. Alright, let's get these thorns going here. Just gonna run through all of this very quickly. Chest, awesome. Alright, please give us some good stuff. Oh, there's another blue item. What is this? Uh, too bad I don't use a bow. Guess I could sell this thing. Yeah, I think, I think as we're getting um, deeper into the game, better things are starting to drop, which is very cool. Very, very cool. Alright, let's go this way. We're, I think we're close to finding out what the source is of the trouble. pack of spiders. It looks like they're all buffed up. Might hurt. Might hurt a little bit. Oh, I can't move. I can't move. Ah, oh, let's go over here a little bit. Like there's a couple different things that drop, like relics. Uh, what is this thing? Yeah, doesn't really look all that great. Yeah, some of this just does not look very good. This, all this stuff is just kind of blah. Let's just keep some space in our inventory open. So that we can have more space for additional loot. Man, these spiders are all looking pretty nasty. Oh gosh. Can't move. Can't move. <laughs> 